Today we've got an interesting microphone. This is indeed the Farfine AmpliGame A8 Cardioid Capsule Condenser Microphone that is advertised for being great for gaming, podcasting and general voice recording. It does retail at £50, that's 60 in US dollars. But the question is, is it any good? Well, let's delve right in. Now as we go ahead and open it up, everything does come very well packaged and protected. So the microphone should stay safe and undamaged when in transit. First things first, we do get a very detailed a user manual setup guide where it will give you detailed information on how to set up the microphone to your PC with various other instructions included, like for example how to switch between those RGB lighting modes. But looking closely at the microphone itself, well the stand is fully constructed out of ABS plastic, all except for that metal pop filter that sits front facing to the front of the microphone. As you may be able to see, there is that embedded Farfine logo to the front. There's also a built-in shock mount into this stand that should, hopefully, reduce vibrations when you're typing on the keyboard when this microphone is placed upon your desktop. Not only that, right from the off, this mic stand is very well weighted. So it should sit sturdy upon your desktop and to help aid with this, there is also that fully rubberized grip to the bottom. Now you do have some maneuverability with this mic stand. So you can place the microphone vertically or horizontal depending on your needs. Bearing in mind though that this microphone is indeed a cardioid capsule and does have that front facing diaphragm. So all audio will be picked up from the front of the microphone with ambient noise also being blocked out from your surroundings. But yeah, quite a handsome looking microphone. But before we get into some of the functions, let's look at some of the accessories that we get included within the kit. Now we do get a standard USB to Type-C audio cable supplied. It's not a bad length, but what we also get is a scissor stand adjustment mount. So if you want to place this microphone on an aftermarket scissor stand that you may have bought, well you can simply unscrew the retaining bolt on the side of the mic stand just like so, pop that shock mount from the stand, insert it onto that included added mount, and at the bottom of that mount, as you can see just here, it has that grooved spindle where you can go ahead and now place it onto the end of the scissor stand, enabling you to use this microphone as an overhead microphone or as a proper studio mic. Let's go ahead and place it all back together. Let's go ahead and plug the audio cable in, placing one end into the Type-C port on the base of the microphone and plugging in that standard USB end direct into our laptop PC. Now, because this microphone is plug and play, it should have no problems whatsoever automatically setting up to your laptop and should only take a less than 20 seconds. If you do have any problems, go through all your mic settings that's built into your PC and set the Farfine AmpliGame A8 as your main recording device. And well, you may have noticed to the front and rear of the microphone just now, the microphone itself is illuminating in this bright red colour tone. Now you can switch between those colour tones and RGB modes by tapping that touch control button to the bottom rear of the mic. So you can switch between that dynamic solid red colour, yellow, bright green, blue, purple and a few other colours such as bright white. Now we do get RGB rainbow colour lighting. Within these colour modes you do have a fast breathing mode, a slow breathing mode and as well as the lighting function you do get a microphone touch controlled mute button to the top of the mic. Now as well as this illuminating function we do have an input gain knob to the rear so you can control the volume of your voice pickup. And not only that, if we revert again to the base of the mic, as you can see just here, there is indeed a headphone socket, which will enable you to monitor your online streaming recording and adjust that input gain knob accordingly to your audio preference. So now everything is set up out of the box, we're going to continue the rest of this video using this microphone itself. Alright guys, so I'm sat about 12 inches away from the microphone just now and we are just going to quickly test those plosive letters such as the B, P and T letters B, 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 P, 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 T, T, T A nice cup of tea, yes, thanks B, 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 pick up a penguin Now we have gone over a few of our voice recordings and I've got to be quite honest this cardioid condenser capsule most definitely captures pristine accurate sound. Not only that, our voice pickup is quite loud too. So let's just turn the volume down just a bit using that gain knob to the rear. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. So we've turned it down around about 15% 
And even though our voice is a bit lower, it actually does block out some of that background static, which is quite absent when using this microphone, by the way. Not only that, this Firefine microphone does certainly do a good job blocking out most of the background noise, such as this fan on this laptop running high speed just now. Alright, I wouldn't say completely blocking out all that ambient noise, such as rustling of paper in the background. But for a condenser microphone that is equipped with a large diaphragm, it is not only good for doing voice recording, but I would say it is perfect also for doing any type of podcasting. Fantastic for gaming, as it is compatible with PS4 and PS5 consoles. Unfortunately, no, it's not compatible with any type of Xboxes, I'm afraid. But not only that, I think that that microphone mute button to the top is very convenient. <laughs> out of breath. Yes, quite a good microphone, very convenient, and you don't have to be sat right up close and personal. Again, just turn that microphone gain control all the way up. And Bob's your uncle. You'll be able to now record two people at one time. Again, perfect for podcasting, and I must admit, it does certainly have an aesthetically pleasing look. Yes, it does, yeah. Well, now we've tested it out, I've got to be quite honest, I do personally think that this is a great microphone for beginners. Okay, it's not an over expensive microphone, but for its price range, I think that the sound quality is fantastic. I definitely think I could recommend this for anyone that's starting out on YouTube or anyone that wants to improve their overall recording quality, as we do get clear highs and stable bass when talking or shouting at a high volume. Like this! I think it's perfectly okay for gaming, and most definitely if you're setting up a little corner for your teenager, and you want to give an aesthetically pleasing look, then this Farfine AmpliGame A8 microphone will certainly be right up your street. I think it does have a very well built design, it's very thoughtful, and in regards to scoring this microphone, well, I think for the audio quality, we will give it a 9 out of 10. Again, for that price, for a desktop microphone, you can't really go wrong, and the fact that we can unscrew it, and place it up on a scissor stand, I do think that is a fantastic feature, and that's why we're going to give a 9 out of 10 for its design. For functionality, again, fantastic uses, we've got the headphone jack, we've got the game control, touch control lighting, and that mute button to the top that is very well situated to indicate when the microphone is indeed on mute, or when you're live. Our overall score for this Farfine AmpliGame A8 condenser microphone today, we are pleased on this channel to give it a 9 out of 10, and I will indeed leave a handy little link in the video description down below for everyone to check out for themselves. Not affiliated in any type of way, but if you are right what you've seen within this video, well again, why not go get yours? Now, if you do go down in that video description, it means so much right now if you please like and share this video. I would really appreciate the support. One other thing I'd appreciate right now is if you subscribe to this channel. Bearing in mind now to hit that bell notification option so you guys stay updated on all our new uploads. Now, I have done a fair few mic reviews this week and I think this one's been fantastic to test out. But guess what? We're going to be back with a lapel microphone this week, so stay tuned for that upload. But hey, as usual, I hope you all stay safe, and thank you ever so much for watching. Yeah. Peace!